Let's get right to it. Stay with me here. This one's a dense one. All AI in the real world is machine learning. All machine learning can be broken down into two broad classes of models. They are traditional models and deep learning models. A traditional model isn't a deep learning model. That's the easiest way to think about it right now. With me so far? As a rule, traditional models are used on and excel on structured data, and deep learning models excel on unstructured data problems. Structured data is data that lives in databases. Unstructured data may have structure, but it's not in the form of a matrix or an array, i.e. a database. Examples of unstructured data are audio files, images, and text documents. Around 80% of all machine learning is done on structured data. One traditional model class is king here. They're called gradient boosters. Nothing beats them on the two most common types of real-world problems, classification and regression problems. Now, that was only a few sentences, but about 10 interview questions. Are you ready? Why would you use gradient boosters on classification problems? The answer is nothing beats them. Simple as that. What are the two broad categories of machine learning models? The answer is deep learning and traditional models. What model would I use for images? Deep learning models, it's unstructured data. What model should I use for documents? Deep learning models, it's unstructured data. What's structured data? It's data in the form of a matrix or an array. What are the two most common seen problems in the real world? Classification and regression problems. Can you give me an example of unstructured data? Images, audio, and documents. And just like that, you know more than 99% of the people who think they know real world AI. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and have a great day. We'll see you soon.